So this is my tech of tomorrow. I'm doing a little something off topic, that not that much techy stuff, but it is still technology. It is still technology. Um, but it's about geocaching. I don't know if any of you do it. You can uh, you can go look up you can go look it up at geocaching.com. Uh, it's a really cool sport. It's not really a sport. It's more like a hobby. But um, uh, I just wanted to make this video for this channel because I wanted to tell you guys I made a new channel called Born to Geocache. Um, now I'm going to be putting all my geocaching videos on there. I only have two so far that I've made. Um, but I made this unboxing video a long time ago, but I never got the time to edit it and um, get it ready for YouTube. So now I'm, uh, I'm wearing different clothes by now, but I'm just going to uh, show you the unboxing now. For my, uh, for my Magellan Explorist GC, it's a little handheld uh, GPS device. Um, I love it, and I just wanted to show it to you guys, so let's get started. Okay, so here it is, and now we're just going to slide off the sleeve here. Um, now, let's see how I'm going to open this. Looks like this is one of the ones that go like this. Okay, here it is. Uh, here's the device itself. We'll just set this to the side. So it looks like we have some legal stuff right there that no one ever reads. Uh, we've got the user's handbook. We've got the, um, looks like something in a different language. And, well that one's probably French. This is, uh, Spanish. We've got a sinking cable. Now this only works with Windows, and I am definitely a Mac user. I'm very disappointed that it doesn't work like sync with Mac, but that's okay because I'm going to enjoy this GPS, I hope. Um, here is a set of batteries, uh, and we've got some energizer stuff. And now, this is what I was looking for. Um, this is a 30-day premium membership at geocaching.com. Um, you have to pay to become a premium member. It's like $30 a year, and... Um, uh, let's see, $30 a year, uh, and $10 for three months. So, uh, if I like being a premium member, then I will definitely buy it, but right now I'm just gonna do the free trial of 30 days. It, normally, GPSs don't come with the free trial, but I guess this one does. So, here, we'll bring in the device. Uh, so here it is, uh, while I'm going to... Oh, here's my magic mouse. Uh, I'll find a way to prop this up for you to look at it. Okay, so let me read you the specs. It is 100% dedicated to geocaching adventures. Um, it, is, it explains what geocaching is. Um, high sensitivity GPS, worldwide base map, AA batteries, waterproof, um, a bunch of... Uh, technology stuff, WAAS, Agnos, MSAS, okay, GPX compatible, paperless geocaching. Now, that's the part that you have to pay for the premium membership. Well, one thing that I already don't like about this GPS is that in order to use, get full advantage of the machine's capabilities, you have to have a premium membership on geocaching.com. So that's why they give you the free trial so that you know, like, what it is. And so, what... What the, it does give you if you're a premium member is it gives you the whole description, hints, and everything on here if you have it. Like, you just plug it in your computer, hit send to GPS, and it gives you the hints, description, everything on here. But if you don't, then it doesn't give you everything, and it still works. But um, in order to take advantage of the paperless geocaching feature, you'll have to do that. It comes with Vantage Point, capable, compatible, uh, high-speed USB, okay. Um... Package contents, uh, Magellan Explorers GC GPS receiver, uh, USB data cable, two AA batteries, a user handbook. Now here are the system requirements. It requires Microsoft Windows XP or higher, minimum of 256 megabytes of RAM, minimum of 1.5 gigahertz processor or higher, uh, CD-ROM drive, minimum of 100, giga 100 megabytes of free hard drive space, USB port, uh, internet connection, and either Internet Explorer or Firefox web browser. Um, so I don't know where it's why it doesn't say it on here, but um, 
this has the Surfstar 3 technology. Um, and I know that for a fact because I did some researching before purchasing this. But I don't know why it doesn't say that on here. Uh, no, it doesn't look like there's a little peely thing on the thing. Uh, let's see what this does. Oh, that pops open the back. Okay, this is definitely waterproof. It has some nice rubber right there. Oh, looks like I'm getting cold. You like my 24 ringtone? If you used to watch 24, that was a ringtone long, long ways ago. Um, when Bill Buchanan was still a boss. And they were like in some underground CTU headquarters thing. Um, but I'm wondering how I'm supposed to put this back on. Uh, I don't want to break this on my first use. Oh, okay. There we go. Like that. Okay. So it looks like this has a little holster thing. Now let me go over what's on here. Oh, it does have a little thing to take off. Okay, so it has a back button, a zoom buttons, a four-way, no, five-way joystick, a menu button, a power button, Jelly Explorist. Uh, here it is. Um, it is a little fat, but I've heard very good things about this, so I don't think that should be a problem. Now, let's just pop the batteries in and power it up. Oh, and here's the USB connecting port thing. I'm guessing. Okay, yeah, there it is. It's waterproof, so it has to be a little hard to take it out. But it's right there. Um, looks like it's a mini USB. Oh, it's perfect. I don't need to open that cord then. Um, yeah, I have a lot of cable things, pretty nerdy. Uh, so, we'll just get open these batteries. Uh, I'll use the knife. Well, actually, I'll use the scissors. I love these Swiss Army knives. Okay. And we'll just pop the battery in. I do not like putting this thing back in. It's a little hard. Difficult, if I do say so. Okay, now just turn this little thing right there, push it down, and we'll power it on. Oh, that's beautiful. You never see the thing power on more than once, that's why. Unless this is the normal one. Now, um, from first look, the text looks a little small on here, and I've heard people complain about that. So it wants to know my language selection. Uh, here, let me try to focus this for you. There we go. Uh, Bosnian, Zetch, okay. English, U.S., and Greenish, English, Great Britain. I'm going to choose English, U.S., because I am in America, or the United States of America. And it wants to know if I accept this user term agreement thing and I accept okay time zone yes I am in PST oh oops oh and it, I'm already in so from here I can go to geocaches oh come on geocaches and looks like map um waypoints dashboard and tools so i'm just gonna give this a shot maybe hit up like three geocaches later today okay guys so you just saw the uh... the unboxing of this uh... magellan explorers gc so uh... please rate comment and subscribe and please go take a look at my new channel if you're interested in geocaching. So that's it for now. See ya.